Hello there, this is JBJ Blaze, and welcome back to another Blazy Log. This is number 43 on December the 19th, 2014, and it's actually been a pretty good two days since the last log. I've actually gotten quite a few things done and started. So, on Wednesday, here I'll start some stuff in the house. Oh yeah. I want to start up a double chest, at least before I do actually need one, so let's get started on that. And while I do that, so on Wednesday, I finally resumed development on my text-based game, which has been in hi on hiatus, and uh, I've said two years and four months, and it's actually been one year and four months. It actually has been on hiatus since August of 2013 and not 2012. 2012 is actually when it began development. So I apologize for that inaccuracy, which I stated in the previ previous Blazy Log, as well as in the comments of one of the previous Morning Coffee episodes by Mr. Brent Copeland. And... I guess speaking of him, I've asked him about twice now about settings with Skype, and I probably not so much XSplit, but I am still currently having issues with audio glitches, because that's still running on in Blaze on Asian episode 19, and I... I, I was editing. I was editing at the At Day's End episode today in Premiere, and guess what I found out? It might actually be XSplit because I recorded without the use of Skype, and yeah, I'm I'm not sure how I'm gonna do up the floor. I mean walls in here. Maybe what I could do is... I'm thinking about having the wall started right up about here. Not too sure, though. And actually, it, it might even... I'm not sure if it would look nicer with stone. Uh, I've heard many times from the shaft peoples that cobblestone just looks ugly, but... I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure what to do. Uh, I'll leave that for later, I guess. But, in other things going on, so... Tomorrow, I plan on it being a big day for releases, hopefully. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna get Blaze on Nation episode 19 out... Tomorrow, but hopefully I'll get... The, the thing with that is because there's so many audio glitches, I'm not so sure that it's really editable. And I've talked with my friend The Thing, who's also a co-host on the show, about re-airing it. So re-recording the episode. And we've discussed that we can do it on Monday at 8 or 8.30 p.m. So please do stay tuned. For whether we do end up re-recording it. And as for other stuff going on tomorrow for releases. I'll also be hopefully putting out the first episode of SCROWS. And then later tonight I'm hopefully going to be getting to live stream the r resuming from the hiatus of my novel called The Cathaholic, which I, I believe I talked about it in the last log. So you can find out about it from there. Oh, are you stuck in that whole little miss sheep? Yeah, I'm sorry. If, if I came down there, there'd probably be a lack of being able to get out. So maybe I'll just leave this. I, I'm sorry. But, it's probably scummy of me, but, well, you gotta do what you gotta do. I have about half time now. 
But other things going on, I'm also hoping to get the last of the At Day's End episode edited and then release that tomorrow as well. Which is where I found out that it might not actually be my Skype client causing the audio glitches. But it might actually be XSplit because I... And I'm not sure whether it's maybe even just having Skype open causes the audio glitches, which I doubt. Which, but it could be because I think Mr. Brent Copeland talked about that on Morning Coffee. I guess there weren't really much sheep, much for sheep, but I'll just put this one away, and I might even have him, no, I, I think it's, I think it is supposed to be about four or, or so, but, yeah, what, what could I do for the walling in here, because I'm not too sure, I really am not, I'm thinking, I, I think cobblestone, but there's a whole so-called ugliness about that. There's also, uh, hey, may, maybe I can make the first bread, make this log a little more special. So here we go, the first bread. I baked some bread, aye aye. All right, put you away now. <laughs> Not, not too much there, but there's a bit. Make some more planks for future need. Uh, what, what can I do with those? No, I, I think those are good there. I still have yet to figure out what I'm going to do inside my house. But in terms of other things going on, I'm... Hoping so what with the X split thing I'm wondering whether or not I should try team speak for calling for for the audio part that is or if it's X split that's the problem then try something like open broadcaster although the last time I had tried it it Well actually open broadcaster worked pretty well just not the whole part of where you can arrange stuff on your screen and all that. Which I don't really like because you can't drag it across the screen and all that. Gotta pick, for example, move to bottom, move to left, or whatever. And I, I just don't really like that functionality. And FF Split, which is another one which I've talked a lot about on Blazon Nation. It keeps on crashing the stream at about maybe a minute in. But also before I run out of time in this log, I'd like to talk about school today. In which, so I have a bit off a of co-op till the second, which is my first day in studio at TV Kojiko for the new year. But other than that, I've also, and I, I'm gonna see about mine in a bit here. And... Other than that going on, I got to find out some new marks today. Well, yesterday I got to find out I have about an 87 or something in my co-op course. Why am I using an axe on there? And then in my computer science course, I have a 91. So, and, and I mean, I love the class personally. But in other things going on, before I really do run out of time, we had the Christmas assembly at my school today. And I was actually quite impressed with the performances we got to watch. Because, I, I mean, the only person who did have to use a lyric sheet, he still had some expression in his vocals. And as for the rest of the performances, just a lack of being tone deaf at all or needing vocals in your background music or even a lyric sheet, which bothers me personally. But it was overall very good. I unfortunately didn't get to audition in time, so I didn't get a performance in, nor did I get my Santa letter read, which kind of 
kind of sucked, but oh well. It was still good overall. But anyway, thanks for tuning in. This has been JBJ Play tuning out. Bye-bye! <laughs>